This is no ordinary illness. <laughs> it is disgusting and painful. Its victims fall into terrible fever and dark despair. <laughs>
Everyone has an ego. A healthy, strong ego is the basis of a successful, driven individual. But what happens when an ego goes too far? When can someone really be called an egomaniac?
baby. I'm saying that because as a teacher and as a therapist, I've seen people basically choose between two things, love or something else.